Hello everybody and welcome back to Mass Effect 2 Legendary Edition again, where we're getting tally. We're getting freaking tally before I freaking forget. Freaking heck. Also, we'll get to meet one of my favorite characters that we don't get to have on our crew and we only get to have a fairly minimal interaction with, but it's Cal Rieger. But first, let me feed my fish. Cal Rieger is why I want- Oh good, they're alive. Love this. I love this so much. Um, Cal Rieger is why I desperately wanted a, um, what's the word? Quarian. A male Quarian romance. Uh, in, what's its name? Mass Effect Andromeda. <laughs> oh yeah, baby. What are we missing? I think in Mass Effect 3 it lets you hover over these and tell you what it are, what it, what it are, what they are, what it is. That's a Geth ship. That's the Normandy. That's a Turian frigate. That's SR1. I guess that's the SR2. Um, it's another Turian ship, I think. And that's like a merchant ship. I can't remember the kind. And that's the SRE Dreadnought that I can't remember the name of. Off we go. No messages for you, Commander. Okay, did we have any new? That Kasumi is an mm. interesting addition to the crew. I can see why she's good at her work. She never reveals anything meaningful about herself. It's all on the surface. It'll be a challenge getting to know who she really is. Anyway, what's up? Is there anything I should know? Nothing right now. Anything else, Commander? That'll be all. It's always nice chatting with oh, you. Oh, thank you, thank you. This time we'll take Garris. Because we're going to go see an old friend. Even though they don't, I don't think they have an interaction. Um, still, you know, for the vibes. What am I looking for? We are looking for... Tally, she's way over here. I know she is. Here she is. Recruit Tally. Way out in the middle of nowhere. I'm sorry, Tally. We're like... I don't know. 40 episodes in. Hey, strong. Okay. Formerly a Quarian colony, Haystrom was established to observe the phenomena on Dolan, the star's parent. But yeah, system's parent star. Dolan appeared to be unstable, with a high possibility of erupting prematurely into a red giant. Haystrom was lost to the guests in 1896 CE. Soon after, all communication from the planet and its attendant space station ceased. The Geth have shown no signs of treating Dolan as a threat. Over the past three centuries, other than establishing several space stations near Dolan's magne magnetic eruptions and solar output, overwhelm most communications near it. It's unclear how the Geth have compensated today. A spy probe scans indicate extensive orbital construction around Haystrom, housing thousands of Geth platforms and an unknown number of Geth software mines. It is not known how many Geth are on the planet's surface. Spy probes face interference from Dolan, making remote scanning difficult. Resource estimations based on Geth mining, refining, and fabricating practices suggest that the planet has at least 20 more years of uses before it's exhausted. Intelligence experts speculate that the Geth have not exploited all the resources because they wish to keep some rivers reserved for repairs. I'm not reading audiobooks out loud at any point in my life. Okay. Oh, shoot, that's right. Let's see. Um. Ooh. Let's try the room. Let's see if that goes. Uh, bring Garrus. I probably shouldn't bring Thane. We shouldn't have two snipers. Um, let's bring... Shoot, we're gonna be fighting a lot of Geth, actually. I think last time I brought Kasumi. She's the best equipped for this. I almost brought Samara, but we'll bring Kasumi. Kasumi! Mm. If it can be fired, Garris knows how to use it. Yep. Let's go. 
Oh, switch. I don't want to use this anymore. I have so many heavy weapons and I'm just so boring. Don't mind me. Recognize those guys from from the last game on a different planet. Shepard, our data indicates that Tally is somewhere in these ruins. There is considerable geth activity in an environmental hazard. Mm. Solar output has overwhelmed Hastrum's protective magnetosphere. Exposure to direct sunlight will damage your shields. Well, good thing the shade is completely safe. Having serious issues with my shield. Yeah, I know. I'm wearing black. Can we get in the shade? <laughs> and I'm wearing black. <laughs> She's a hoot. We're gonna go get Tally. Should be, should be super stoked about this. Ah. The missile launcher is the ugliest weapon to Incoming drop ship. have on your back. This is so weird. I mean, I can't aim normally, so I can't blame it on. Really? Oh, jeez. That's so violent looking. I got the upgrade I did to champion because my cooldowns just are not in Ooh, look at that. That's interesting. Uh, my cooldowns are just non-existent. It's great. Are there any more up there? Nope. I think there are, actually. Yes, okay. <laughs> I was like, wait a second. We are definitely roasting. We definitely shouldn't be here. Oh, I'm gonna die. I, I should have gone the other way. I realize that. But listen. Listen. I am the type of woman that sees a brick wall as an invitation for my forehead. Incoming dropship. I don't I don't do subtle. I just don't. Oh, did you Oh that's not fair. I'm like trying to stand in the shade. <laughs> Scratch one! Oh my gosh, you scared the crap out of me. Oh. Well, maybe you shouldn't stand all oh, jeez. doing much better at just running in and meleeing people. Maybe I could change to the shotgun now. If I play it this way. Gal, Kasumi from the side looked like a Korean and I was like, oh my gosh. I was trying to fix it. I feel like there's some audio stuff going on in the background. Yikes. Oh, I should. Nope. Nope. 
perfect. Cow Raker! We're just picking up these bot these 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 things from the dead quarians. The pistol we got earlier was also from the quarians. I love you! Cal Rager! Marry me! This is Commander Shepard of the Normandy. Can we provide assistance? <laughs> Status of your team. How many of you are left? We were a small squad, dozen Marines plus the science team. We're down to half strength now. Made the synthetic bastards pay for it, though. What brought you this deep into Geth-controlled space? You're asking the wrong person, Shepard. I just point and shoot. I love him. Something about the sun. It's going bad faster than it should. Some kind of energy problem. Any idea where the Geth came from? to worry about the guests sending in reinforcements? I don't think so. Their patrol ship hasn't lifted off again. The radiation blocks all off-world communication. We hope, anyway. How are you holding up? We can be there in a few minutes. Take it slow and careful. Direct sunlight fries your shields all to hell. We're bunkered down at base camp across the valley. I left Tally Zora at a secure shelter that doubled back to hold the choke point. Getting Tally out safely is our top priority. If you can extract her, we'll keep him off you. You got confirmation that the Geth haven't reached Tally yet? Affirmative. Left my best friend. Phew. Get ready to talk to her on the comm. Every Marine on this rock is sworn to protect Tally Zora. As long as one of us is still drawing air, she'll be safe. I like that little touch where she's like, because her face can't express relief, but like, she like, woo, rubs her head. You're gonna throw your life away for research? Negative. Old position. We'll hit their back ranks. Wait, watch your ass. We got a dropship coming in. Dang nabbit. Well, why don't you just do that to us? And we could just doorways blocked. Grab the demo charges in the buildings nearby. Use them to clear a path. I could definitely walk behind that rock. I could definitely walk behind it. Oh no. Oh jeez. Look at me go with this upgrade, it's amazing. This armor is working really well. Oh, okay, fine. Do I... The guy on the radio said something about mining charges. They blow this rubble. I could, I could, I could squish in there. Up ahead. Actually, go for the cryo ammo. Oh, dear. Mm-hmm. 
I'm such a good example. Oof. I hear you. I, I swear I heard him up there. Oh, excuse you. Oh, jeez. Oh my goodness. Oh, I'm trying to get behind you. Oh, we have to go that way. My mouse freaking sensitivity on my controller. Is... No bueno. My shields are down. They have a. We can deal with these guys now. That's what we can do. And I need my sniper. This is slowing down. I didn't do anything. There's <laughs> oh, no. Okay, okay, time to bring out the big guns.
Tally's journal up there? What? come up through here? I think we did, and I just missed. Yeah. No? Yes? I just miss all of this? Potentially. Um. I know I had the demolition charges. And I can go. But now I'm curious. Yeah, this is just okay. Just a different route. Um. So unfortunately, they don't really come back to the decaying star, but somebody told me in the comments a while back oh, um, that it may be related to something in Mass Effect 3 that they go back to. The dark matter and like stuff like that. What was it? Dang, I can't remember. I apologize. Charges are go. Oh, jeez. <laughs> hey, look at this. Was it? That's really fr it was. It was something that made sense, but it didn't play like a huge part in the story. I think. I'm sorry. I know. I even know who told it to me, <laughs> and I'm just an incomplete, and I can't remember what it is. Well. This was their living quarters. Gorian architecture. There's two words you don't expect to hear together. This deep behind Geth lines? Hope the Quarians got what they were looking for. Yeah. Our ancestors walked these halls with uncovered heads. The sun must have been normal back then. So much space. Walls of stone. It's amazing. I wish my friends could see it. I wish Shepard were here. She's still thinking. Tell me go to base camp. Oops. Come to base camp. One second. Um. It's true though, like Quarian architecture, like I mean they 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 didn't even I mean they built their ships, but it's not the same thing. Architecture is technically non portable and uh, a ship is technically portable. But you can still say like ship architecture, but no yeah, like the point remains, you know. Tally, it's Shepard. I'm sorry. Everyone here is dead. Any survivors must have fallen back. We knew this mission was high risk. Damn it. And what are you doing here, Shepard? We're in the middle of Geth space. I'm looking for you. I was in the neighborhood. I thought you might need a hand. Thanks for coming, Shepard. It means a lot to hear your voice. Call Rieger and what's left of the Marines got me into the observatory. From where you are, it's through the door and across the field. I got the data I needed, and I'm safe for now, but I've got a lot of Geth outside. What is this research you're after? It's about this world's sun. It's aging faster than it should. I can tell you more about it once we've got fewer Geth shooting at us. Would it help if I brought in the Normandy? Doubtful. These buildings are centuries old. If you bring down heavy fire, this whole place could collapse on us. They always have to come up with a good reason why I can't use my ship. Because it's a first-person shooter, that's why. <laughs> it's not a turret game, and it's not a and it's not a space battle simulator. But they they always throw in a few excuses. 
Is anyone else still with you, or are you alone out there? Rieger had a team of Marines covering me when I ran for the observatory. At least some of them are still alive. I can hear them firing at the Geth outside. It looks like somebody sealed the door against the Geth, and the console's damaged. Can you get it open on your end? Uh, let me see. Yes, I can do it. Here. Should be unlocked now. Be careful, Shepard, and please, do what you can to keep Rieger alive. Of course. You keep that man alive with everything I've got. Oh yeah, baby. Where are we at? Nope, nope, nope. Almost there. Um, anyway. I'm gonna go ahead and call this one here. I'm actually not sure how short it might be, but regardless, we're on our way to get Tally, and I'm very excited. And I wish that this architecture actually looked like Korean architecture and not like, oh, what is the brutalism? That's what it is, that architecture style. A very brutalist architecture. <sighs> be cool if it actually looked cool. Anyway, I almost forgot. We're, we're ending it here. <laughs> but thank you all so much for watching. I appreciate it. Um, and really quick, I want to say thank you to my patrons, to all my patrons, but to especially Reese Galito, my sapling tier patron, and Christopher, my tree tier patron. Thank you so, so much for your support. You're the super bestest. Thank you. Um, and I hope everybody has a good night or a day, and I'll see you in the next one.